A drab draw at Lyon last time out for Clermont, a woeful defeat at Biarritz to get out of the system for too long, for whom Joe Van Niekerk reclaimed the captaincy from Johnny Wilkinson for this game. Second hosting fourth, and a Clermont win would put clear daylight between themselves and their pursuers. Morgan Parra kicked the game's first points for the hosts. He'll be involved in the Six Nations, Johnny Wilkinson won't. That's to Toulon's advantage, and the Englishman levelled it up. Toulon's pack had problems at Biarritz, and the front row went down here. Para made them pay, and it was 6-3 to Clermont. Another fine Wilkinson strike restored parity at six apiece. From the restart, David Skrella tried to catch Toulon out with the switch kick. It didn't go 10, and the next thing Clermont saw was Benjamin Lapère streaking down the touchline for the former Albi fullback's first try of the season. Toulon in front after a terrible mix-up from Clermont. A gift-wrapped score as Toulon strived for a third away success of the campaign and to become the first club to win at the Stade Marcel Michelin since 2009. Thanks to Wilkinson's conversion, Toulon led by seven points. Para and Wilkinson then exchanged penalties before home captain Aurelien Rougerie and visiting hooker Jean-Charles Orioli were both yellow carded two minutes before the break for a scrap. The penalty went Clermont's way and Para knocked it over for a half-time scoreline of Clermont 12, Toulon 16. Para cut the gap to one in the second half before Wilkinson pushed it back out to four with 20 minutes remaining. Toulon backs coach Pierre Mignoni, a former Clermont star, would have expected a home backlash and it duly arrived. Julien Malzieu, the big winger recalled to the France setup, made the burst and passed inside for Rougerie to score his first top catalyst try of the season. Malzieu dummied, then ran hard, beating tackles from Stefan Armitage and Wilkinson before gifting his skipper the score. Clermont in front then. Para converted the try and added a penalty as Clermont scored a six-point win. Just the bonus point for Toulon, now third in the table, but a whopping ten points behind Clermont with 11 games left to make that up.